Well, once again today, people rallied against a proposed pipeline. This proposed pipeline is different from the one that would run through Mobile's drinking water supply. Instead, this proposed pipeline would travel through Pritchard, Eight Mile, and Africatown. Today, stakeholders in those communities met to voice their opposition. Pipeline leak, trains crash. Keep your tar sands off our track. Yesterday, they marched. Today, in the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. They prayed for divine intervention. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. 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 The Mobile Environmental Justice Action Coalition wants to stop another proposed pipeline project dead in its tracks. Um, these corporations don't care about us. They never have, they never will. Plains Mobile Pipeline Inc. has asked the Alabama Public Service Commission for right of way to build a crude oil pipeline that would travel through Mobile County. Africatown is along the proposed route, and residents there are concerned. And Lord help us all if there was some type of a, a accident. Joe Womack says the pipeline also interferes with plans to develop the area as a tourism destination. Uh, look around you. You see the green grass, and, 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 and of course, you go beyond that, you see waterfront area, and, and we want to see that developed, you know. Would you like to come to a tourist attraction where you will see pipelines? and tanks that's holding oil in your area. Today's rally both informed and energized the opposition movement. And we have to choose whether we're going to get run over by this concentration of activities that are suddenly uh, erupting here or we're going to stand up to it. That's, that's the choice. And the hearing for the proposed pipeline will be in Montgomery on October 30th at 10 a.m.